I'm gonna show you how you would use ink wash to paint a lit sphere, one that has a highlight, shadow, coarse shadow, and a cast shadow. Um, I would begin, well first I would begin by drawing a circle, and then I'm gonna start with a light value ink. And I'm gonna paint what is going to be the darker values later and then gradually let the ink dissipate as I get close to where the highlight's gonna be. I'm gonna make the light coming from this direction. So at this point you have two options. You could wait for this to dry and go in with that same layer or same level of ink value or maybe add a little bit more ink to it and then just let the layers build up that way. Or you could go ahead and go in and use wet into wet technique because this area is going to be a little bit wet with just a darker value ink. You want to be careful doing too many layers at a time because if you're rubbing your paintbrush back and forth over and over again in the same area, your paper is going to start to crumble. So this is probably as much as I can get done in this area before I let it dry. Um, and you'll find that you have more flexibility depending on the paper that you're using. The paper that I'm using is, does not have a lot of flexibility. I'm going to have to let this dry and begin a new layer later. What I'm adding to it now is water because I want to diffuse that value as it goes up. So I'm just adding water right now. All right, I'm gonna let this dry and then I'm gonna go back in with another layer later. At this point, the sphere is dry and I'm ready for another layer. So I'm just gonna go in with a dark value and use my water to spread it out and lighten it up as it gets towards the top. I can even use a paper towel to blot it if I've got too much ink in order for me to lift up. All right, and I'm gonna let this dry and go back and get another layer into that too later. All right, I'm gonna go back in with another layer.
And you can continue to layer this and layer this until you get values that are as dark as you want. 